Senior conservatives have denounced Theresa May as too weak to unite her cabinet and run an effective government after she refused to sack her foreign secretary, Boris Johnson, for breaking ranks over Brexit. Johnson infuriated Tory MPs on both sides of the European debate when he spelt out his own personal vision of a hard Brexit in a newspaper article only days before May is expected to outline possible areas for compromise with Brussels in a speech in Florence. Downing Street insisted that May still had full confidence in Johnson, although he had not informed her of the content of his article. Writing in the Daily Telegraph, Johnson insisted that the UK must not pay any money to the EU for access to its markets after Brexit and made no mention of a transition period after 2019 to avoid a cliff edge for UK businesses. May is now understood to back a transitional deal that could involve payments to the EU for access to its markets during a period of two to three years after Brexit, and to accept that the UK will need to follow the single market rulebook in that time. Johnson's article was seen across the Tory party as the start of a leadership campaign to replace May, in which he would position himself as the champion of a clean break with the European Union, in contrast to May and the Chancellor Philip Hammond who are pushing for a gradual exit. Several former Tory ministers said yesterday it was clear that Johnson was setting out his leadership stall and tempting May to sack him, in the knowledge that she had not got the authority to disown.